Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Hello, and welcome back to Space Quest Five. Um, don't you think we get a little, a little light speed, you moron? <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. Uh, oh, sorry. Yes, of course. Hi, Hi sir. Hi, sir. <laughs> All right, we're on our way to the space bar, which I absolutely love in this game. Definitely a place that, like, when I got to this point in the game as a kid, I would kind of, when I stopped playing, I would think about it, you know, and be like, what if I was on the space bar hanging out, <laughs> having a good time? <laughs> so cool. I love it. We're going to have an uh, option um, when we get there. Well, actually, you know what? We're approaching our destination, Captain. Let's Let's talk about that in a minute. This place is a little bit like Monolith Burger, the we, McDonald's in space from Space Quest 3. I just thought it was so cool. Are we just gonna like blast right by it? Yeah, I'll go to regular speed. Hi, sir. Hi, sir. Where are you, space bar? I'm somewhere. There it whoa, is. whoa, whoa! Yeah. It's got a. It's like it got an olive in the top of it. <laughs> it's very cartoony. All right. Um. Evasive action! Uh, <laughs> there's nothing around here to evade, Bonehead. I mean, Captain. <laughs> okay. You want to go into orbit? Yes, that's right. Um, I guess that would be... Standard orbit, yes. Standard orbit, eh? All right, then. Yeah, baby. There she is. Beautiful. I love it. That's a cool place to chill. I'd hang there. Mm. I would party. Bro, I'd hang there, bro. <laughs> Flo's like, whoa! Let's party! Last one down to the station is a rotten or at ovum. <laughs> so many buttons down there. All right. <laughs> Love to party. Goodbye. All right. Man, they were they were excited. Yeah, they were they were they're gone. A freaking gone, man. I gotta beam down. Yeah. Guys? Is Cliffy coming too? Uh, yeah, oh, Cliffy's yeah. there. Can't wait to get crunk dizzy, oh, crunk well, nasty. Oh, Alright. <laughs> I... I... Thank you for waiting. Guess they thought I was with them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they must have uh, gotten confused. <laughs> Energize! Alright. Uh, they, they fucking hate your guts. They don't hate me. I mean the cat. Uh, mm. <laughs> Do they respect you by the end? Here we are. Well, we'll find out, won't mm. we? Excuse me, Captain, but I see an old buddy over by over there by the bar. Uh oh, here we go again. Dude, look up here. Look what? up in the corner. Oh, it's maggot. Maggot dung heap and uh, maggot and who could that be with him? That's- that's your boss, dude. It's your toupee boss. You- The Nova Station is home to the galactically infamous space bar, and on the main port of- It is- and is the main port of call for ships on- on Liberty in the G6 Quadrant. Man, I'm having trouble reading today. I like the giant lava lamp. This alien looks vaguely familiar. Vaguely? You don't even notice it's your boss? Yeah. A huge lava lamp is the capstone to the retro decor of the Star Confederacy watering hole known as simply as the Space Bar by its clientele. It's really cool. Yeah, I love it. Gonna lie. The last time you saw a creature with a mouth that looked like this, it had a big hook in it. <laughs> <laughs> with Sprint long distance teleportation systems, you're as good as there. <laughs> <laughs> is this game sponsored by Sprint? Yeah. <laughs> um. You gotta talk to. They. Yeah, I just, I just like looking around first. Okay. I'm just having a drink. Uh, uh, uh. Go walk over to my friend. Yeah. <laughs> ah, friends! Hello, my friends! You got here early. <laughs> Bet they're stoked to be hanging out with you. <laughs> Beep boop! <laughs> here you go. Hello! I'm the cocktail waitress and I'm like. What's your poison, humanoids? I'll have a double bourbon on the rocks. I'll have a fuzzy nostril. Give me a green goblin. Here you are, business drinks. 
The charges will be deducted from your stock on account. If you feel the urge to hurl, please feel free to use the restrooms, human. Oh boy. That's so cool. <laughs> Can't wait for that. If you need anything, let me know. All right. Oh, we're being approached. Oh, hello. By a dude. <laughs> What's up, everybody? <laughs> the name's Cracky McCrack. <laughs> hello there, sir. I mean, partner. May I have a moment? <laughs> well, actually, I'm kind of. Allow me to introduce myself. The name's Nilo Jones, Merchant of Venus. Ooh. Dealer in fine collectibles, trafficker in rare artifacts. What's your moniker, son? I'm the uh, Roger Wilco. Well, Wilco, this is your lucky day. I could tell the first minute I set eyes on you that you're a discerning individual with an IQ significantly higher than the chair he was sitting in. A man who knows the value of fine merchandise when he sees it. Well, uh, never fear, Wilco. Nilo can fix you right up. Need some Antarian fire water? A few gray market copies of the latest thing quest game? <laughs> Things quest game? Or a lucky Tribble's foot? How about some Chernobyl cufflinks? <laughs> They're a guaranteed collector's item, you know? Guaranteed to give you that warm glow like only hard radiation can. I don't think... <laughs> I can see you're looking for something special, Roger. Can I call you Roger? No. Well, I've got just the thing. Dehydrated space monkeys. They're all the rage in the colony world. You don't have to feed them, and there's no mess. For you, 15 buckazoids. I'm not sure. You drive a hard bargain, Raj! I'll tell you what, you take a free sample of Space Monkeys and my business card with my compliments. Then you buy something for your lady friend next time you pass through here. Uh, thanks. Realizing he's not going to make a big score here, the sales beast moves off to find another victim. <laughs> the sales beast? Yeah. <laughs> well, <sighs> I got somebody else to annoy. Yeah, pretty much. Oh. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. Oh. And there's Quirk. Oh yeah, he left the the upper area. I'm in the lower area. Now I'm here. This mm -mm. freaking dickbag. Well, 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 look who it isn't. Buzz off, laser brain. <laughs> Enjoying your new command, trash man? I recommended you for the job. That sanitation engineer to you, crumb. Oh, an aristocrat. I bet Ambassador Wankmeister would be really impressed. <gasps> you think? She and I are having a great time working together. Closely. On the Goliath. <laughs> Quirk, you have the looks of an Orat and the manners to match. Why, you little. I could have you brought up on charges for that. I demand satisfaction. Strange thing to say. I <laughs> challenge you to a game of Battle Cruiser, wimp. Fine. I'm gonna kick your aft side into the next quadrant, Quirk. <laughs> we'll see about that, broom jockey. All right. So now we have the option to play this man at Battleship. <laughs> what, it, really? It's just a fun mini game. You down? Uh, yeah. Sweet. I Let's mean, Battleship is Battle Cruiser. I feel like Battleship's a little random. Well, here I'll, I'll show you how it's played. Um. Or the game will show us. Yeah, Battle Cruiser objective. To seek out and destroy all four of your enemy's cloaked ships. Each player will take turns firing either a proton torpedo or a probe. When a ship is hit, blah 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 blah. Okay. You must first place your ships on the map. Alright, I'll show you what to do. Huh, that's cool. Yes. Is it because you only have limited photons or something? Okay. Yes. So let's save it here. Save. We're gonna play Battle Cruiser, baby! Yeah! Alright, here you go. Well, that's quite a quite a a list of saved games you've got going on there. I might I might lose. I might lose. Okay. Well that's okay, because we have a save state. We can just erase history and then do it again. That's true. That is pretty great. Mm -hmm. Although I don't think there's any consequences if you lose. I think you just get less points. Oh, I see. Alright. So we have three sectors in which to put our ships in. I'll put one here. Ooh. Floaty, floaty. I'll put one. I'm gonna rotate that sideways. One here. Huh. Next ship. Interesting. One. One up here. So if you probe, does it say like? 
Yeah, it'll become super obvious. Okay. Um, next chip. Okay, here's my big, my big boy. I'll rotate and put him. Yeah. You're a wall putter, dude. Yeah, I like the walls. Um, done. Does four ships? Yep, that was all four. Okay, so sector one. Uh, all right, I'm gonna send out a probe. Let's see if I can find something. Put the probe here. Nothing. Huh. No nothing in that upper quadrant. All right. Oof. He just he just fired. Yeah, he just really went nothing. for it. Yeah. Psycho. <laughs> you sicko. You make me wanna vomit. All right. Okay. I'll so send out another probe. How about? Meow. Meow, <laughs> see? Damn. Nothing. nothing. All right. So nothing in the top half of that sector. Dang. Yeah. But now my probes are gone. You don't need more probes? No, you only get two probes. Oh. Yeah, so now I just gotta start firing. Oh, I oh, hit something! Yeah! Wow. wow, that was lucky. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of... space. Yeah. That's the thing about space, man. There is a lot of it. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, okay. Interesting. Nope. Interessant. Muy interessant. Grab that cruisy boy. Do you have to get everyone? Oh yeah, you have to you have to blow him up completely. Oof. Ooh. That was that was very close. Scary scary. Daddy no likey the closies. Scary. Okay, good. Ow! Good, good. Don't hit any of my shit. <laughs> he's coming for your shit, dude. Yeah, he's going right after my shit. Um let's try here. Okay, Oof. good. Yeah! Oh, nice. I found the tiny boy. Skadoosh. Yeah. <laughs> My scout ship. <laughs> that's, a, <sighs> that's a perfect voice for him. Oh, coops. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Oh, I got a probe. This is a man's game. Don't you... Okay. Ping. All right. I can rule out sector one completely. Oh, okay. I see your strat. It's a good strat. It's a big, healthy, naughty strat. Ooh, it's a good strat. It's a great strat. All right, sector Ooh, two. Baby. Ooh, baby. Hit. Yeah! Boy, I'm really getting lucky. Or you're skilled. Okay. Boy, he sucks. Well, I mean, he's just shooting blindly. <laughs> It's a dumbass. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is good. This is good. What a stupid bastard. And then now. Uh, Maybe he's like. Let's see what kind of ship this is. Scanning with his photon so he can get like a really accurate probe hit, you know? <laughs> Very possible. Or he could just be being an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think he has probes. Not a very good admiral. I what? think this might be the plus sign one. Oh, no, jeez. Where is this thing? You might have hit like the tail of the... Yeah. I must have. Of the something. It's got... It's gotta be here. Yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff, daddy. <laughs> daddy I think, I think that's stuff. the ship that I've got of his. It could be the T-shaped ship, too. Tinky, tinky, tinky. Oh, yeah. This is good. This is very good. Keep not hitting my stuff, you dingleberry. I mean, at this point, you've you've got him. I. You know what? I'm in really good shape. Oof. Yep. Oofity loofity. Nice. I'm so glad this is working out well on the uh, on the playthrough where everyone's watching. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's the plus sign. Yeah, time. baby. And now I'll get another probe. Squad douche. Another probe. My starbase. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Whew. 
Jeez. Boy, I'm getting very lucky. I need to dance around all your ships. I gotta probe, I gotta probe. Probe it up! Probe it up! Nope. I wanna see uh, the probe get a hit, man. I don't know, but I've been very fortunate. I mean, I've eliminated half of the... the grids now. Yeah. It can only be the lower half of Sector 2 or Sector 3. Let's try... Meow. Nope. That's a miss! Miss it! Okay. <laughs> Good. This guy blows. Yeah, he, he sucks. Of course, he is just shooting wildly and blindly into the... into the night. Dang. It's such a helpless feeling when you're out of probes. Yeah. You're just like, uh... uh, uh, uh bang! Yeah, n now we are actually just playing Battleship. Yeah, Battleship with three boards. Yeah, I like it. It's 3D Battleship. It's like too much. I think it's kind of a cool idea. If you had the probes. Yes. The probes Rinky definitely make it tinky tinky a little... Tinky. ...less intense. So what's left? The T-shape... Yeah, you got the T-shape and then the big A-wing looking thing. Hmm. Could have threaded the needle, though. Yeah. That's- that's the problem with this. You just don't freaking know. I wonder um, if there's like an optimal battleship strategy. I never really looked it up. There's gotta be. Cause you know, there's those games where it's like, Oh, well, in checkers, the most efficient move is to do this, this, and this first. Dang. But it's like battleship, what is it? Like, you do it like a diagonal? Yeah, I guess you just wanna like... Like with the probes, you know, you wanna grid out as much as you possibly can. Like... This could conceivably be... Cause now he's got only the big... Ship left, more or less. This is gonna... Uh, this is gonna take a hot less. minute. Um... I would switch to second three. Yeah, it's personally. time. I just wanted to... Grid sweep. out a bunch of... Uh, Give it a good sweep. Yeah. There's only one more place that it could be. Yeah! Oh my goodness. Naughty, naughty. You sneaky little bastard. I'm wrecking this guy's whole goddamn shop. What if he was just like drunk as shit and <laughs> he's just kind of like like asleep on his feet, like, uh, uh, bitch, just bitch. For, just beat me in proton, proton <laughs> game. I think I might have found his big one. Proton boy. His, his, his big boy, his big nasty boy boy. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> it, if I found- nice shot, douche. <laughs> if I- if I found his, like, little, uh, starfighter, he is effed. No, I found the big boy. Well, ain't that something. You suck, dude. <laughs> so then wow, up, I did- you- you one from the second one? You were right, I did thread the needle. Yeah. Look at that. Oh my god, I- I just missed by like... Two different times. That's a battleship, man. It's, battleship is a cruel mistress. Yeah, it's like you can never- you never really know. Unless you checkerboard the entire- Yeah. Wow, wow. This guy's so after right now. <laughs> I wonder if he found it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he, oh! Fi he finally found one of my boys. That's okay. I've got a massive head start on him. Who invented Battleship? Some genius. Stop! <laughs> So uncool! Oh god. Ah, jeez! It's gonna take for freaking ever to find, uh... ...to find his little rinky-dink final ship. But that's okay. His T. Yeah, his T-boy. Cause that could actually be hiding. Yeah, oh um, yeah. Amongst this nonsense. <laughs> I can't! I don't know where it is! I'm so scared. No! Oh, you I, fool! I wasted a turn. I wasted a turn. I mean, it slipped. Whatever, it doesn't matter. No, it matters, Aaron! <laughs> Way it's <ahead>. the barrel! <laughs> but it's. It, 
<laughs> but Dion. Yeah, that was really nice that you found the small one like right away. Yeah, totally. That's the that's the hardest thing. Hmm. Oh, blast you! You nailed my large battle cruiser, you weed. <laughs> you weed. I love weed. <laughs> As an insult. Is that a weed? <laughs> I'm calling the police! You freaking weed. Alright, uh, Sector, sector 3. three Alright, let's grid out as much as we can. Probe! Hit it, baby! Nope. No such luck. Oh my god. Dude! Um, dude! Um, dude... Why don't you just put it in the center? Probe in the center. Well, I mean, you just want to grid out five by five. Uh oh. It doesn't matter which, um, to, as, as far as I can tell. Um... Hit! Oh, no, would have been sweet. Would have been so very sweet. Give me that hit! Give me that hit! Give me that hit, give me that hit, give me that hit. I wanna see the hit, I wanna see the hit, I wanna see the hit, it makes me good. Right in my pants. <laughs> What do you think shape this is? <laughs> what, like, <laughs> he's not that bright. Honestly, though, like, I got very lucky. This is, you win this about fifty percent of the time. It's it's not that easy. So it's it's nice that the computer gives you like a little leeway. I'm gonna lose. Wumpy tumpy, wumpy tumpy, wumpy tumpy, wumpy tumpy. Tumpy, 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 tumpy. <laughs> uh, nope. Yeah, I guess it could be there. Yeah. I'm just trying to take out, like, as many possibilities. This guy's a dumbass. Yeah, this guy sucks. This guy sucks all the balls. I mean, we knew that already because of his- on, on account of his character and the way that he's written. Mm -mm. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh! oh! I know it's around here somewhere. He's... I know you're around there somewhere. You stupid little bitch! I'm gonna screw on you! I'm gonna screw on you! I'm gonna screw on you? I'm gonna screw on you! What does that mean exactly? I'm gonna screw on you. I'm gonna screw! Screw! You know? Uh, on me? Yeah. I'm gonna share them with proton tunes! I'm gonna screw on you! Yeah! I'm gonna screw! <laughs> gonna go on you. Um. Right there. There it is. No. But, but, he's running out of options. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> you dumb bastard. Does he just want to outline it? <laughs> <laughs> Feels good. Feels good to outline yeah. things. I'll put that on r slash oddly satisfying. Oh, oh boy. Oh, fiddle fan. There it is. Ah, no! Scoopity boopity! You nailed my command ship! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not the only thing I'm gonna be nailing. <laughs> Good work, Aaron. Your butthole. <laughs> was that not clear? I was getting to your butthole. The butthole. <laughs> oh! Son of a whore! <laughs> Scoopy doopy, dude. Yes. Keep swinging in Sector 3. Yeah, he's checkerboarding it, dude. Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm doing the exact same thing. <laughs> Son of bitch! <laughs> when I do find this thing, it'll be a... a real triumph of the human spirit. It will. I agree with you. Oh! Mm, that's a miss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ding dang Daru. Just thought you didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Where the heck is this thing? I don't know, man. Maybe here? <laughs> yeah! Oh, there's the hit we were looking for. This guy's effed now. He just shot in the same spot he shot before. Oh, no, no maybe not. No. That's impossible. Boy, I just missed with my probes so many times. Yeah. There it is, pointed downward. Yep, son. That upward dick. You're effed. Everyone, everyone watching this see? Come and see how good I did. Yeah. Put this on the big screen! Go on! Oh. Oh, hello. 
What the? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I see. It's like right outside the range of your probe. Yeah. Because it's like a circle. Oh, maybe. Yeah. How about that? Tail end. <laughs> How about that? So close. But uh, so far. Wait. So far, so good. I don't understand. Is it pointing? The tail's on the left, I think. Oh. Oh, no. maybe not. Where the hell is this thing? Uh, fine. I thought I probed there. I don't know if the probe is 5x5. Five five. Yeah, maybe it doesn't cover as much ground as I initially anticipated. Oh. Where is this thing? Yeah. The tail's gotta be on the right end, then. Yeah, it's gotta be. Dun, 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 dun. No! <laughs> boy, boy, that, that thing really clicks off whenever it dang well feels like it. Okay. <sighs> really... Really building up the anticipation. Yeah. Thank you, goodness gracious. Yeah, I guess it's only like a 4x4 kind of deal. Boy, that was a cruel probe miss. Yeah, seriously. Let's finish this. Yes! Cut the head off the Hydra. <laughs> and burn it. You destroyed my destroyer, punk! Freaking jerk. I won! I won! Wah! <laughs> Outstanding. Eat a dick, Quirk. To finish the game with the maximum number of points, you'll need to beat Quirk without losing any of your ships. Oh, uh, whoops. Oh, well. <laughs> Why, you dirty, no good. Oh. Oh, nice. Bar fight. <laughs> What's going on here, Cliffy? Captain and slug bait crewman from the Goliath called our ship a garbage scow. I just couldn't sit, sit there and let him get away with a... He, he. Cliffy, the Eureka is a garbage scow. <coughs> oh yeah, I forgot. But he didn't have to go rubbing our noses in it. I've heard enough. Guards, place this man under arrest and toss him in the brig. Just a minute, Quirk. You can't just... I can and did. Now just stow it, Wilco. Or you'll end up alongside him in a detention cell. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to get back to my ship. I wouldn't want to keep the ambassador waiting. <laughs> what a tool. Aw, poor Cliffy. We hit you with my wrench. You just get, just get drunk. <laughs> just catching a buzz. <laughs> oh man. Oh, poor Cliffy. All right, I know what to do. You do? Yes. Oh, okay. I this I remember very clearly. Um, first I'm just gonna have a nice little chat with these guys. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> okay. Get lost, Pinhead! Your attempts to take command of the situation do not meet with success. Oh, that's oh. Just the inner monologue. The cell appears to be as empty as the orb atop your shoulders. Dude. Unlike the other detention cells, this one seems to be occupied. Alright, well, that's gotta be where Cliffy's being held. So I'll just waltz back here. Take take a little seedy seat with my with my friends. A little seedy seat. With my with my tasty friends. <laughs> I don't know, he's back. <laughs> yeah, right. Back to cold. Did you notice the alien sitting with Quirk in the upper booth when we came in, Captain? <gasps> what about him? Well, I have an excellent memory for cranial configurations, and I swear it was the same creature we saw in that transmission we intercepted. What do you suppose it was doing with Quirk? I have an any idea. What do you think, Drool? Beats me. I, 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 hold on. I'm button, button. Beats me. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I didn't even see him when we came in, is yeah. what I said. Why did you say, uh-oh, here we go again when we came into the bar? Cliffy had a slight misunderstanding with the crew member from the Intrepid the last time we came in here. What do you mean by slight misunderstanding? Apparently, Cliffy made some colorful speculations about this crew member's parentage. <laughs> then he proceeded to make some unflattering anatomical references. <laughs> I get the idea. He talked about his penis. Males, <laughs> you can't live with them and sometimes you can't even house train them. 
Why, that reminds me of my 14th husband, Vlad. He was always brawling. The captain doesn't have time to listen to one of your fascinating personal narratives right now, Flo. He has to figure out how to get Cliffy out of the slammer, right, sir? Uh, yeah. See, I told you the captain wasn't a complete closet case, Flo. I'm with you, sir. Let's go blast him out. That's a fine idea, Drool, but it would draw too much attention. There's gotta be a better way. Mm, nope. <laughs> All right, let's take a look. Blast him out. Let's take a look at what we got. Space monkeys. A package of dehydrated space monkeys, given to you by the sales beast at the space bar. A small label at the bottom reads, Warning, do not allow contents of package to mix with alcohol. Hmm. I think we all know where this is going. <laughs> I'm throwing the alcohol. Oh. Whoa. Uh. Whoa. Uh. Um. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, Look at him! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Love getting mixed with alcohol. <laughs> oh man! Well, oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, 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 oh no! Oh, oh. oh and I didn't save my battleship uh, victory! Uh, no! No! Uh, All right, be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, I'll have a slightly less amazing score because I just skipped the battle cruiser game when we restored. Um, Do you get some for having a higher score? Nah, just like credit. Bragging rights. Yeah, yeah. People think you're cool, but it's fine. <laughs> we're, we're. Oh. I'm not in it for the personal glory. We're here to save the galaxy. Got man. it. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. All right. So I just released the space monkeys, and now they're all up everywhere. <laughs> Who's a moron who let all the dang space monkeys loose? <laughs> go who? Go who? Wee! I love that one. <laughs> wow! <Wee>! <laughs> <laughs> Look at that guy still yapping away. These pseudo primates seem to possess a pronounced proclivity for procreation. They like fucking. That's basically what he's saying. All right. Well, I'll see y'all later. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep. Now that I've created a havoc wreaking diversion. That's hilarious. It's good heckin' stuff. <laughs> Hello! Stop! So I'm outside the airlock on an EVA, and I hear the phone ring. I gotta climb in, cycle the airlock, decontaminate, climb out of the pressure suit, and run to the phone. I hate that. Turns out, it's one of these new phone companies wanting me to switch to galact long galactic long-distance carriers. And he's talking about all these big savings I could get if I just switch from Sprint to TTNA's Friends and Aliens plan. Can you believe it? What'd you tell them? I said no way, it just isn't worth it. Uh, I don't care. <laughs> Alert! Alert! Come on, let's go see what it is. Maybe we got to beat somebody up. We'll just- we'll just leave everything defenseless here. Yeah. Um... Okay. Touch. Touchy. Oh, alright. Touchy. Alright, me walkie here. Walkie. Oh, oh, whoa. oh. Little oh. force field going all on. Alright, let's just push that button then. Okay. Now you can walk through, you silly goose. Alright. You thought you could just walk up to the thing, you can't do that, you're a silly goose. Oh, it's Cliffy! Cliffy's <laughs> locked up tighter than the sphinctoid on a Regillian waterfowl. Gross. Sphinctoid? Boy, am I glad to see you, Captain. You've got yourself in a fine predicament this time, Cliffy. I'm sorry, Captain, but it wasn't my fault. I know, Cliffy. I know. You're not gonna just leave me here and rot this tidy cell for the rest of my life, are you? Of course not, Cliffy. Eureka isn't going anywhere without her chief engineer. Heck, nobody else can even figure out half the jury rig contraptions you've installed. It's nice to feel needed, sir. Now, all we have to do is get you out of here. Any ideas? Not a one, sir. Maybe you can find something that'll get me through these bars. Get through these, but be careful. It's mighty cramped quarters in here, and I'd like to make it out of one piece. <coughs> His voice ain't easy to do. All right. I know what to do. Yeah? But it requires a quick beam back to the ship. Oh. A little bit of, uh... Are you going to enlist a friend? Holy shit. Whoa, it's like way more... Um, uh... Uh, the space monkeys are reproducing at an alarming rate. You could be in big trouble if you don't get out of here soon, Roger. The station isn't going to be able to take the added pressure of so many space monkeys for much longer. <laughs> okay. What do they eat? 
I don't know. They just bang a lot. And reproduce. You gotta eat something. Spike! I need you! <laughs> oh, your little boy. Yeah, come here, my little friend. But you gave him an antacid. Yeah, he's chill. He still got acid blood? Yeah, well, uh... Yeah. He'll be fine. <laughs> Go oh. in there. Alright. Suck on these nipples. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Do your worst. Goodness me. Slash best. <laughs> Yikes. Energize! Okay. Still playing Pong up there. Yeah, oh, it's a- Oh boy, there's a lot of space monkeys now. <laughs> Man, everyone has abandoned the hell out of this place. Eh, it's probably a party, man. Yeah, it's fine. I mean, it's fine. Look at them, they're chilling. All right. Hang in there, Cliffy! <laughs> this is definitely timed. I love how they don't, like, come in here. Yeah. That, that wouldn't make any sense. <laughs> All right, buddy. Uh... Spike. Do your thing, Spike! <laughs> I love that he just, like, piddles on everything. <laughs> Good boy. Oh, what a good boy. Who's a good, good boy? boy? Who's your good boy? Who's my good boy boy? He's wagging his little tail. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. I guess that little beastie is good for something after all, sir. You still got my cigar. My cigar. Let's get the hell out of here! Spike just gone now? No, no, no. I, I put him back in my jacket. Oh, okay. I would never- Never leave a man behind. All right. Yep. Yeah, let's just, <laughs> just, just gonna go ahead and get out of here. I'm hurrying. I'm hurrying. <laughs> I love Cliffy. <sighs> Sproing. You gonna get you? Get, oh, oh, is this the part where you get energized with a space monkey or whatever? What? You get goofed. You get the flyed. Oh no no no! You get Cronenberg. No. Yeah, I guess I'm still waiting for the mutation part of the next mutation. Yeah, hang in there. This game takes you a lot of fun places. Yeah. Can they survive in space? Well, they're space monkeys. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, well... Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let's, let's get out of here. <laughs> I love that they get, like, full squish. <laughs> You just- is this just gonna happen forever? Oh, okay. I'm receiving a coded transmission from StarCon, sir. We are ordered to proceed to Clorox 2 for an auxiliary garbage retrieval mission, sir. Alright. Okay. Clorox 2, baby! Well, first... I'm gonna take my boy Spike and put him in his little home. Cause- Oh, yeah. I don't want anything to happen to him. You don't want his little acid, uh... Goo. His little acid butt to- Bore a hole through my chest. Yeah. That's understandable. Whoa, you okay? Yeah, no, I just... yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I... no. <laughs> Not at all okay. You see Cliffy crawl in there? Yeah, I just go in the hole. Yeah, see you later. This is where I live. Oh! Oh, hello! <laughs> um... Uh, friend or foe? <laughs> WD-40 is an Annihilator android originating from the planet Oakhurst 4. Yes, Captain. Um, how's it going? I'm finally operational and all my circuits are functioning perfectly. Yes, oh. Captain. Oh, cool. Alright, well, great. <laughs> Back you go, little buddy. I will kill you. <laughs> no, uh, 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 what? And seal him up tight. Beep. Aww. There you go. I know. Don't you get so attached to him? He is. He's our little special he's boy. Gooping around in there. Yeah, he's, he's all like, happy. Woo, woo, I'm gooping. <laughs> I'm uh, gooping. Round uh, the ball, I'm gooping. I get to goop. I love gooping. Whoa, Black Betty. Goop a lot. <laughs> goop a doop. -a. Goop a doop. <laughs> Have you ever seen the video for Black Betty by Ram Jam? No. It's. It's very 70s looking. I've only ever seen the... <laughs> the Kung, Kung Pao. Pao. <laughs> Beware about this song about big butts. <laughs> he beats you up while he plays it. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you know what? Let's save. <laughs> How about we learn our lesson for once in our lives? 
<laughs> he beats you up while he plays it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he's like crying while he says it. Go for it. Totally. <laughs> totally gonna crash. Again. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> but we're saving it, and we're making that sweet, sweet progress. Let's go to Clorox 2, baby. Clorox 2, I'm into it. Yep. I forget what happens here. Alright, lay in a course. Hit me with those coordinates. Guess. Uh, 59274. It's a famous five-digit number. Oh, you 812? No. Oh, what is it? 90210? Yes. Really? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Perfect. God, we live close to there now. Yeah, I know. Co coordinates locked it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's go. Light the icer. <laughs> I love the tire skid sounds. <laughs> yeah. They crack me up. Hello. <laughs> what do you want, sir? Looks like we're stuck with another ch crummy job again. Are you really surprised, sir? No, but I just thought they might give us a break. Fat chance. By the way, Captain, what you did for Cliffy back at the station, it was really great, sir. A lot of commanders would have just left him there to rot. And that diversion was the space monkeys. Very creative, sir. It was pretty brilliant, wasn't it? Now don't go getting all puffed up on me, Captain, <laughs> or I'll have to smack you upside the head. Okay. <laughs> buttons, buttons. Ah, oh, hello. Flu's been looking at me kind of strangely lately. You wouldn't have any idea why, would you? Hmm, I really couldn't say, Captain, but I think she was very taken with the way you handled the situation that back there on the space station. Confidentially. I think she kind of likes you. Oh, God. <laughs> ah, what? <laughs> Tell me about your mother, Drool. Um, I'd prefer to keep our mothers out of this, sir. Though I must admit I've entertained some rather amusing speculations about your progenitors. <laughs> How can I help you, Captain? Oh yeah, everyone's getting way nicer. What do you know about Clorox 2, Flo? Not much, Captain. Just that it's a small colony on the fringe of the G6 quadrant. The name seems to ring a bell somewhere, but I can't quite place it. Why don't you go in the back and lie down? I'll bring a cup of hot tea and give you a back rub while you think about it. Huh? You wanna give me a what? A back rub, sir. You lie down, and I'll st start with your shoulders and work my way down. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink, sir. I think Flo's opinion of you has somewhat altered, Captain. Uh, no thank you, Flo. I think I'm fine for now. You have a cute butt for an uptight white boy, sir. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Do you think we'll get in trouble for that little accident back at the space bar? I certainly hope not, Captain. By the way, that was a very brave thing you did back at the space bar. I just love the way you took charge of the situation. It gave me moose bumps. Moose bumps? <laughs> They're like goosebumps, only bigger. I see. Oh. Did you ever do it Regellian style, Captain? <laughs> <laughs> I can't say that I have, Flo. Once you had green, you'll know what I mean, sugar. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. All right. Uh, what were our last orders again? <laughs> Starcon has ordered us to proceed to Clorox 2 for an auxiliary garbage pickup, Captain. We're approaching our destination, Captain. All right. Wish I could try it Regalian style. <laughs> Aye, sir. Regular speed. Shh, oh, I wish I could get a back rub and take me back there. Do, do a little back rub. Go down, <laughs> way down. Oh, we've arrived, sir. <laughs> there, there she is. That's strange. I'm not tracking a waste beacon. Maybe we should investigate. I can put us into orbit and take a closer look at them. Yeah. Put us in a freaking orbit! Standard orbit, eh? Alright! Uh, here we go! We- we are here. Closer, standard orbit. We're- Oh! Drool, where are you going, man? I gotta go pee. <laughs> this looks like a little suspicious. I better go down with you, me in the transporter room, Captain. Alright, Drool! Wow! So much for that go fuck yourself attitude yeah. that they gave us for so I'm, long. I'm coming with you. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna help you out, buddy. I love you. Cause you're my buddy. Mwah. So cute. I'm going with my lobster friend. Yeah. You should talk to WD-40 before you go, though. Think so? Yeah. Alright, I'll do that. <sighs> nice skiing. I'm ready to go when you are. Let's get going. 
What do you make of this situation, WD-40? There are two possibilities. Either the colonists cannot answer or they will not answer our hells. In any case, it is our duty to investigate. Okay. Oh, alright. I guess you had to do it in the, the red button. Oh, alright. Hold on. She's supposed to scan the planet. Ah. Excuse me. Good catch. I wouldn't have done that. And I would have missed out on valuable information. Oh. Whoosh. Oh. Whoosh. <laughs> I oh, hello. <laughs> missed you. Oh, hmm. All right, back to work. Love you, missed you. Uh, let's see here. God, you look great. All right, chill out. Boop. What function may I assist you with, Captain? Scan planet. Atmosphere, nitrogen, oxygen, carbon dioxide, lots of gravity. Oops. Do you require anything further? Scan planet. Planet can support. Uh, scan for ship? Yeah, I guess so. Scanners do not detect any ships in our area, Captain. Uh, I guess... Recommendation? Uh, sure. Oh, was... <laughs> Did you see that? I guess it's just... Uh, I'm fully operational and all my servants are functioning perfectly. 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 <laughs> uh... I make a recommend... Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, I guess all that stuff activated without you having to do it. Oh, great. That is all. Well, you sure goddamn wasted my time, Aaron. I'm so... S you know what? I was just trying to help, and you're coming down on me like a... Like a pot pie on a summer's eve. <laughs> what does that mean? Because it's hot and it's hot out. It's just, you're just bringing on the heat, you know? It's not what I need. Stop kicking the ship, Cliffy. Wish you were a <laughs> fucking <laughs> goddamn it. <laughs> Shit sucks. It's so great. Um, okay. How he adjusts his, his shirt. He's like, oh, yeah, gotta pull my belt up. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> eh. All right. Energize. Okay. You said it very nicely, Captain. All right. And down we go to Clorox, Clorox 2. 2. This place looks lovely. That's straight up Tatooine. Yeah, it is. <laughs> this may be dangerous, Captain. Let's split up so we can cover more territory. It's a terrible plan, Drool. Don't you think we should stick together? Only if you make, make a quick wardrobe change, sir. <laughs> oh, yeah, because he's wearing red. Oh, got it. Now isn't the time to play fashion critic, Drool. It's just that your shirt is so well... Red, sir. It's bad luck. Now, all right. It is. I just, just moseying. Whoa. Tumbleweeds. Oh, I thought it was a creature. No. Jeez. Okay, here's what I remember. Scary. I need to go this way. Okay. And see this canister. Oh yeah. A suspicious-looking object, for which you can't quite discern from your present location, is wedged in the rocks above you. Interesting. Yes. So I walk over here. Oh. Must be hot here. Yeah, it's... <laughs> this is Curly, the third moon which orbits this dusty planet. Oh, are the other ones Larry and Moe? You better believe it. <laughs> wow. I know. You gotta walk into the tent. I do, but there's a little thing here. I go this way. Get a little, oh. Uh, <laughs> oh. The canister bears the phrase primordial soup and the logo, the logo of the Genetics Research Corporation. Oh. A small label near the bottom bears the ominous inscription, biohazard, teratogenic substance. Whew. Do not expose <laughs> to direct sunlight, air, or water. Do not ingest, inhale, or allow contact with exposed skin. Another fine product from Genetics Research Corp. 41666, Sector G6. <laughs> so somebody was playing God here. Yep. The Surgeon General warns that handling a toxic waste container may be hazardous to your health. All right. <laughs> That's an interesting idea. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. All right. Here we go. Walking down to the tent. Walking down to the tent. I'm down here now. <laughs> Look at me! This is where I reside. Rolling along with the tumbling tumbleweeds. Alright, let's just save the game. Yes, good idea. Yep. <sighs> totally gonna crash again. 
definitely about to die. <laughs> okay, super. Love it. All right. Let's see what happens when you walk into this, uh, this alien friendly structure. friendly looking tent, yeah. This building has a large hole ripped in the side of it. That's probably good. The windswept colony is eerily quiet and deserted. Cool, that's a good sign. Two, ter two terrestrial moons named, named Larry and Moe by the colonists are visible above the horizon of Clorox 2. <laughs> Hastily yeah. sealed up buildings indicate rapid abandonment by their occupants. Yeah. All right. Let's walk in there and see what we can see. Something scary must have happened. Yeah, something not good. Something scary. Ooh, look scary. at this. This is a friendly place. <laughs> look, plants. The colony greenhouse is a shambles. Broken computers and twisted machinery have been strewn about everywhere. Is a shambles? All a shambles. Not here. <laughs> Not here. Not here. Um... Oh, the small computer console appears to be the only piece of machinery in working order inside the entire greenhouse. Let's take a look here. Ooh, a computer. Ah! Oh, crap! Ah, oh, 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 shit, oh, dude! Oh, ah! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Uh, uh. Oh, that's right, he's gonna spit loogies at me. Well, well, well I'm sure an ugly one. I was once ugly like you, but look at me now! Perhaps I can make you pretty like me. Hmm. Now try and dodge my death loogies, <laughs> monkey boy. <sighs> you know, a little hemorrhoidal ointment will clear that rash on your face right up. Now get off me! Ah, uh, her hub. Oh. 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 Nice reflexes. Try ducking next time. <laughs> All right. Definitely about to die. Oh my god. Hey, well, I was right. Yep. You called it. Nice reflexes. <laughs> <laughs> nice reflexes, dumbass. Kind of got that opinion. It looks like an eyeball. I love his. I love Roger's response. Like, oh! <laughs> <laughs> I will spit on you. I'll give you a death logo. <laughs> <laughs> this is disgusting. <laughs> this is really silly. How oh. ah. Fucking drool. It hurts. Hell yeah, buddy. <laughs> nice shooting, Tex. I thought I was dog meat for sure. Hey. He's a real looker. I'd better scout around and see if there's any more of these creatures I can blow away. <laughs> Meet you back on the ship. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, pew, pew, pew. Creatures. He's undergoing some kind of metamorphosis. Like still? Oh. Oh. Arg. Thank you. At last I'm free. What happened here? Entire colony. Mutated. Uh, finger points. Bad soup. Secret path over the ridge. Ah. Uh. What a bunch of gibberish. No. <laughs> it's all words that mean things. <laughs> all right. Well, we saw the bad soup. A late, the late colonist is now part of the corpse corps. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. That will not be of any help. All right, let's get the fudge out of here. As you look at these flies, a wave of vuja day washes <laughs> over you. A sense that you've never encountered anything like this before, but will again sometime in the near future. I love that joke. Is that a real thing? No. Oh, okay. I, but I've made that joke a million times because of this, like, a, as a reference to this. <laughs> hmm, that small piece of paper wasn't there before. Oh. Grab a little paper. Hmm. All right. Let's take a peek. The battered scrap of of pa wow, the battered scrap of appears to have some writing on it. <laughs> okay. Maybe they just thought it looked like papers enough to where they were like, oh, "I already wrote papers." Yeah, exactly. Um. Okay. Eight oh eight six nine. Type it into the console. Yeah, I guess. 
Good memory. Thank you. Activity log. Personal log. Clorox 2. Colony Administrator Harry Carey. To Stardate 30216. That wasn't the right number. Something very strange has been going on here in the colony since the Goliath's last visit. A small survey team is a week overdue, and there have been reports of strange creatures roaming the Badlands. No doubt it's a, just a bit of cabin fever by the more imaginative types, but I'm worried by the disappearance of the survey team. Personal log. I'm becoming more and more alarmed. The search party dispatched to learn the fate of the survey team hasn't reported back for more than 50 hours. Fear spurred on by more wild rumors about the creatures has the colony on the verge of panic. <sighs> God help us! A band of the hideous mutant creatures attacked the colony last night. Very few of us escaped the massacre, and I've been wounded slightly. There's no doubt that these creatures are intelligent and even appear to have a rudimentary understanding of technology. Mm. They've captured the shuttle pad, cutting off our only means of escape. Using my personal passcodes, I've sealed the colony so that the creatures will no longer be able to get into any of the undamaged structures. I am in agony. The wound I received burns like fire. An hour ago, the mutant creatures blasted off in the colony shuttle. As they climbed the boarding ramp, I got my first good look at a creature in daylight. It was hideous. The tattered rags he wore were the remnants of a survey team survival suit. I have a terrible suspicion about the fate of the colonists. I'm now utterly alone on this planet. Dying. I hope. <laughs> Damn. Jeez. Sick. That's a bummer. Bro, that's metal as fuck. I guess that's the guy we just shot. Yeah. Uh, bad soup. <laughs> uh, tomato. Sorry, bud. Overcooked. Burnt soup. Let's see what's back here. You looked at the... Yeah, you got the genetics lab coordinates already. Oh yeah, that's right. What were they again? Uh, 41666. Okay, cool. Yes, that's all we need to do. Now use your communicator! And let's get the hell out of here! Looks like a toilet when you have a... <laughs> this is Eureka. Go ahead, Captain Wilco. One to beam up, Flo. Oh great, just when I was finally starting to unwind up here. <laughs> you shut your mouth! <laughs> <laughs> Flo? Damn it! <laughs> get back to work. Alright. Um... That's uh... I hope that robot doesn't kill me. Yeah. I consistently hope that robot does not kill me. <laughs> I'm really, really hoping this robot doesn't kill- Robot? Holy- Robot? Holy crap! <laughs> Are you gonna kill me? Yes. Well, Cliffy? Okay, well at least you're honest. <laughs> Can't say I don't appreciate your work. <laughs> you're doing great in the science lab. Not so great at killing me. Love that he's reading- <laughs> uh, 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 Mad Magazine. Just, uh, reading, uh, reading the magazine. Hmm. I'm picking up a weak signal on an emergency frequency, Captain. I'm putting it on screen. Okay. Oh, Mayday, Mayday. This is the SCS Goliath. Any Confederation ships in range, please respond. Quirk's all scared. Uh, SCS Goli Goliath, repeat, we're under attack. They came through Shuttle Bay. Oh, crap. Ew. I'm sorry, sir. I've lost the transmission. The message was too brief to pin down the exact source, but I've narrowed it down to the region of the Thrakis system. <laughs> Meanwhile, on the SCS Goliath. Ooh, we're getting meanwhiles. I know. It's it's coming to a head now. Meanwhile! Oh, shit. These are bad on the Goliath. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> well... Sorry, Captain Quirk. Shouldn't have put my face on that frying pan. Everything sucks now. Drool? <laughs> just wanted to smell the eggs. Yes, What's your read on this situation, Drool? Hard to say, sir. That whole business back on the planet definitely pegged the weird meter. Something really stinks around here, and I don't even have a nose. <laughs> <laughs> but I just put on a fresh batch of roll-on. Not you, sir. I just meant that something fishy is going on. And I have a sneaking suspicion that Quirk may be involved. What makes you think so? Clorox 2 is in the Goliath patrol sector. If anything happened to the colony, Quirk would have been the first one they called. Holy crap. Yep. Ah, hello. Thanks for, <laughs> Thanks for saving my butt back there on Clorox 2, Drool. Oh, no problem, Captain. Besides, I've always wanted to try one of those quick draws. Yeah! Well, you really saved my bacon. 
I'm just glad I can still shoot straight after the nerve injury to my hand. Gives me to give me the shake something awful. <laughs> awesome. That's why I like the buttons. Yes, dear. Button, <laughs> button, button. What do you make of the Goliath's last transmission, Flo? It was highly irregular, sir. Quirk sounded like he was in big trouble. You're right. I've never seen him so upset. Except maybe that time when he fell on his fanny in front of Ambassador White Wankmeister. Did you notice his face? It looks like he's developed some kind of skin problem. I once had a nasty rash similar to that. It was awful. I couldn't sit comfortably for weeks. What should we do about it? I recommend washing the affected area daily and require wearing an antibiotic lip balm. Very useful. I was talking about the message flow. Oh, well, in that case, I think we should try to rendezvous with the Goliath and render whatever aid we can immediately. I was talking about the uh, transmission. Where'd you say the Goliath's transmission originated from? The transmission came from the vicinity of the Thrakis system. Thanks, Flo. You're welcome, sir. Oh, so pleasant. If you want somebody to blow you later. Okay. Let's lay in a course. Hit me with those coordinates. You got it. Thrakis is 53284. Captain. Thank you, Ensign. <laughs> okay. All right. Coordinates locked in, sir. Ready to get underway. Yay! Yeah. I am the guy who drives the ship. Light speed, please. Aye, sir. Light speed. I must tinklies again, Aaron. Oh my god, you're a tinkle fiend! I know, it's because I drank an entire quart of water while we've been sitting here. A quart of water? A quart of, a quart of water. Be right back. <laughs> Have you ever hey, went? Finish your story. Oh, yeah. Um, this guy who was 15,000 years old, uh, I asked him how he got 15,000 years old, and he told me, um, that it was, it was jerking off every day. And I was like, I do that. And then he was like, ha ha. Just tricked you. I just made you admit that you jerk off every day, and I was like, I'm not ashamed. And then he was like, Oh, and then we went to a roller rink and we rolled around for a little bit. And he was a really good skater, and he taught me some cool moves. And to this day, we're still friends. Skater, no readings for the Goliath captain, but I'm picking up an escape pod. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, um, uh, uh, is it timed? Is the game timed? I don't know how to use the game. <laughs> Dan, I'm scared. Pull your head out, Captain. We just missed our destination. Now we're gonna have to lay in a course again. Ah, shit. You didn't go to regular speed? I did. You stinky boy. I did. Light speed. The racket system. Yeah, you need to put in the, uh, the coordinates again. Uh, uh. <laughs> I gotcha. I got you covered. Uh, All right. I'm scared. The controls. I don't know how to do anything. Back in the hands of a capable I'm man. Scared. Laying a course. All right, Thraka system. One more time. Uh. Oh, now you need it. Five, three, two, eight, four. Here we go. Thraka system. Yeah. Uh, coordinates locked in. Sorry. Now, here we go. Are we just gonna, like, be there? Do you, can you just go regular speed? No, unfortunately. You have to light speed again. Yeah, because you light oh, speeded are. around right it. Here. Oh, alright, neato. Okay, great. Standard orbit. Standard orbit, I. Okay, great. This seems like a friendly place. Ooh. Thrakis is the place where I want to go to, baby. All right, let me ask the science officer. Got a lot of medias. What function may I assist you with, Captain? Scan the planet, WD-40. The atmosphere of this planet is highly toxic to human aid life forms, Captain. Oh. Do you require anything further, Captain Wilco? Uh, scan for ships? In indeterminate reading, sir. If there are any ships within scanning range, they are jamming us. Do you require any fur? Okay. <laughs> Recommendation. The most logical course of action is to beam down to investigate the source of the beacon, Captain. 
I recommend an expedious survey, however. My calculations indicate that 67.5% probability that another ship is within range of the marker beacon. Mm, expeditious. Expeditious. Oops. One more additional piece of data, sir. The atmosphere of this planetoid is highly toxic. You must utilize a breathing apparatus on this surface, surface or perish. Okay. Do you require anything else? That is all. Yes, Captain Wilco. You are dead. Yeah, jeez. Do I have any breathing apparatus? Dead men. Um... Yeah, there's a... There's a, uh, yeah. Um... Is there a suit somewhere? Leave the bridge. Yes, there's a red button. Ah, is this it? Yeah, I think so. There we go. Okay, I remember now. Whee! <laughs> I forgot about this room. It's the pod bay. Yeah. Oh I yeah. Love... I've been down here the whole time. Just banging on shit. <laughs> <laughs> you shut up. <laughs> Hi, Cliffy. Hey, what's up? It's Cliffy. Whom did you expect? Great use of whom. I'm too tired to talk just now, Captain. I've been beating away at this wall for hours. Okay. Um, uh... Let's uh, pop this puppy open. Uh, left space suits. There yeah. we go, yep. Sprigadicking! Did you just get a spacesuit? I got a helmet, I think. Oh. Oh, yeah. look at you, Mr. Mr. Man. All right, guess that's Mr. not necessary. Mr. Mr. Man. Not here. All right, let's take a look at this uh, control panel. Okay. Docking bay, airlock, elevator door, pod rotation. Ah, pod rotation. Beep. Uh, just go back to engineering. Rotate that pod, baby. Oh, okay. For what purpose are you rotating me, sir? Because <laughs> I'm going to get in you. Oh, I see. Starcon regulations prohibit use of the EVA pod situation except for, oh, rescue and emergency situations. Uh, you want to go back up to the... Dang it. The engineering. No, right. But I want to use the pod! But <laughs> I gotta use the pod! But Hello? damn! Oh, maybe I need to... I someone to get me to do. Maybe the door function is here. Elevator door. There you go. I got it. Uh, <laughs> everyone relax. Captain has it under control. I've <laughs> learned how to use the elevator. <laughs> Don't everybody clap at once. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Back up we go. The ship is cool. Yeah, it's pretty dope. Yeah. I, I love hanging out on this place. Um, oh, you want to teleport to the planet? Yeah, it's time. It's go time, baby. Hello, Captain. You're fucking dead. Have fun on the planet! You better believe it! Do I put this on yes, now? Yes, you do. Boop. Ha ha! Yeah. Looks like a scuba mask. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> see ya! Let's see. Ah, oh, look at this highly toxic. Yeah, this planet looks highly toxic as hell. Mmm. And uh, shall we explore it next time on Game Grumps? We shall. Yeah, let's save our game for the love of God. Oh, please. Every time, man. Uh, goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Oh. <laughs>